Good morning, Chicago. It's time to see that beautiful view from our hotel room. <laughs> I didn't even know that was Oh, yeah. View. Look at that brick wall. <laughs> Ooh, looks nice. Chicago! Chicago! It's so beautiful. Okay, so we had our meeting this morning and we just came back to our hotel room because I was wearing heels and I want to change into comfy shoes and we want to go walk around. I'm tired today. John's tired too, I think. Don't, yeah. Do my eyes look tired? I think my eyes look tired. But still, we don't have a ton of time here. We just have today and then um, we check out tomorrow, but we have like the whole day here. So we were gonna leave our suitcases in the hotel and then go explore and then go catch our flight. But we need to, to get out and about. We need to get out and about. We need to shake off this tiredness, like whatever. Tired is mental, it's a mental state. Okay, we're gonna grab a coffee downstairs on our way out. We may have also ordered a bottle of sake with our lunch after our meeting, so sake. that might be part of feeling sake a little tired. Me, I like these chairs. Have you seen, I don't know if you guys have ever been in a hotel with more elevators at your disposal, but there's like- Yeah, there's a lot. 15 elevators that you can take. Is this like a convention center too, maybe? Yeah. Okay. I think, I stayed here once when I was a kid with my dad, and it was like, I really liked it, I remember it was really awesome, but I think they like converted it into like a full-blown convention center since then, so it's a little different. Mm. So they're showing all the movies that were shot here. Home Alone 2 was shot here. What? My best friend's wedding. All these movies were shot in this hotel. Also, John, this is how I imagine you. Dolphin rider? Yeah. Well, it's not like a dolphin. dolphin. It's like a some kind of fish. That's how you look like when you're fishing. You're like, yeah! Woo! Dolphin rider. <laughs> it's making fun of me. Stop making fun of me. I have a really hard time with revolving doors. They scare me. Let me out, there's a guy behind me. Oh, Stop well. doing that to me. <laughs> Is it just me? Does anyone else find revolving doors extremely scary? You have to go at the exact right minute. It's too much pressure. It's too much, it's really scary. It's not that scary. It is. I might be more scared of the automatic ones than the manual ones because I, you know, then you, then you're on somebody else's schedule. But it's not that scary, Nikki. Well, it's not as scary when you go alone, but when there's other people pushing it, then it's like right. you have to go at the exact right show. moment. Chicago. Where are we going? Are we going to the Bean? What bean? There's a giant it's bean in Boston, Chicago. It's Boston, Nikki. No, there's a bean. That was how the whole thing got started because I asked if Chicago was called Bean Town, and then it turns out it's Boston. Yeah, I'm which stuck on it. No, there's a there's still a giant bean here. That's why I thought that Chicago might be called Bean Town. You mean the big silver reflecting yes. thing? That's a statue and not a bean. It is a bean. They call it the bean. I don't think it's a bean. I'll oh have my to gosh! They, of this. they actually call it a bean. We, it's not far from here. We can walk that way. But right now we're walking to the Great Lake of Michigan. <laughs> the Great Lake of Michigan. Wow! Look at that view. Chicago is big. Wow! That's a lot of cars. What a scary intersection. It's Chicago. A lot of people. So I didn't realize Navy Pier was just right here. Yep. I didn't know we were so Why close. Why call it Navy Pier? I think it used to be like a Navy Pier, but now I think it's more of a tourist attraction. Well, yeah. Hey, I'm just. I think, to, I think it used to be to like more of a viewers. Navy Pier. <laughs> and this is one of the five Great Lakes. There's Lake Superior, uh, Lake Michigan, Lake Huron, Lake Erie, and whatever the fifth one is that I'm forgetting. But there are real lakes are like they're so big that they're basically like miniature oceans. The biggest lakes in the world, right here. <laughs> I'm you oh my it. gosh, it's getting so far. I'm you got it? <gasps> oh my god, that's so cool. <laughs> Wait, it's okay, I'm sorry, I got really excited. Scared them. Maybe that's they don't like pretzels. I like how they're like a little nervous at first and then he's just all up in your business. 
Oh, look at the cute little doggy! He's hissing at the dog. Oh. He literally was like. <laughs> Do you want some too? <laughs> yeah, look, he has one over there. <laughs> we'll get one from John. Goose, goosing around. I'll get it for you. Scary. Scary goose. Make it nice. We just walked by and said that they like ducks too. It's a goose, it's a goose people. It's a goose, Can not a duck. You? Duck and geese. Okay? Ducks and gooses. Two different things. I just pet a wild goose. You can get Norwalk virus from him. What? What's that? Norwalk virus? <laughs> Like this goose does not. This goose does not like the geese in the water. He's totally flexing on him. Okay. Oh, <laughs> you're <a> clumsy goose. <laughs> he, he, he like pretends like he's eating stuff out of the ground. You try to play that off so cool. <laughs> the Great Lake Michigan graveyard. All these graves out here, one after another, just like Louisiana. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was thinking. <laughs> Just making fun of me because I go, are those graves? Yeah, and then no. I'm like, wait, no, mailboxes. Not even close. Yeah, they're, they're mailboxes. <laughs> That's actually what they are. They're mailboxes for the dead people. For anybody watching the video who doesn't know what those are, uh, they are, this is a boat marina. This is where they park boats in the summer. In the winter, they pull all the boats out uh, because this area can freeze and it can cause damage to the boats. But yeah, nope, not graves, not mailboxes. They're called slips. I figured it out in like one second, okay? And I figured it out on my own. Third try. Second try. You clearly said graves, mailboxes, and then boats. Oh, they're not mailboxes? No. I thought they were mailboxes no, for they're, the boats. They're plugins. <laughs> and power. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, look how beautiful that looks. There's like a lot of really great photo opportunities and it's hard because we don't have anyone else with us to take pictures and I just think it looks so pretty like the light here and that river like the, it just gives you the perfect silhouette with the buildings in the background. It's gorgeous. Okay, so we made it to My Millennium. Dogs are barking. Your feet hurt? Yeah. We've been walking a lot, but you know what? I think it's good because when you travel, you eat a lot, and it'll make me feel a lot better if I look at my phone. It says I did 20,000 steps. I walked two, three miles close to that. A long ways around to get to where we were going, which is right there. There it is. The giant bean in Bean Town. <laughs> you alright? <laughs> I got that on the vlog. <laughs> it's so shiny. That's cool. You can see like the whole city reflecting in it. Whoa, it looks weird in the middle. It's crazy because you can't tell like how far away this is. You can, it's weird. It's like an optical illusion. It like hurts my eyes when I try to like look right, at it. Right, because your brain can't make sense of it. Look at that. Does it do the same on camera? Can you not tell where the top is? Because it's like way, way weird. That is really cool. My favorite part about it is the skyline that reflects. Yeah. Like, it's just so cool. It looks it's awesome. It's crystal clear. I'm actually really glad we came and saw this in person. I want to know who built this. It kind of looks like a giant butt from this angle. A giant butt. It does kind of yeah. look like a butt. Does my butt look like that? <laughs> but I've seen a lot of people like post pictures of this on line I didn't and know stuff. Where it was. Well, it was it's in San Francisco or something. <laughs> really? Well, I've seen pictures of it and it's kind of like, yeah, okay, that's cool. But it looks really, really it cool in really real life. Bad. Yeah. Kind of like, you can't really describe the I mean, it looks. the photos don't do video, it justice. The video doesn't capture it, but it's crazy. It looks really cool in real life. But. Okay, so we only have a limited time to try all of pizza the food again. in Chicago, right? That's what I was trying to say. Well, we're getting pizza again. No, what I am trying to say is we've been splitting every meal today so far. But we're not getting any of my pizza if this is where that conversation's going. No, I'm asking, does that mean we get That's to have six? <laughs> I am going to have one of your pizza. Bites. 
but does it mean we get to have six meals today? If we've been splitting each meal. Uh, maybe. I just I get three, you get three. You're not getting zero pizza. But we've been splitting everything, so I just lawyered my day. Okay. <laughs> we can eat more to try all the food here. Oh, gotcha. I even like moved the camera down as I looked. See what's so cool about the sausage pizza pies is it's like a whole patty of sausage on the top. It's so good. I like the crust. Yeah. I don't remember Chicago style pizza being this good. I guess not. I don't know where I went when I came when I was 18. Domino's. <laughs> Domino's. Close. I don't think so. There's a fence here. So look, you can get in through the middle. Oh, I guess it's not closed. That's weird that they have just a fence. I don't think there's anything going on here though. We came to Navy Pier. We finally made it down. Oh, oh no! I win. I no! Told you. Okay. So we finally made it down to Navy Pier. When we were on our walk, we couldn't get over here. There was like a divider or something. And so we river. went. River? Yeah. Big we, river. Well, we went back to the hotel, sat in the hot tub, and then took a cab over here. And we wanted to have dinner here, but it's closed. Yeah. We're going to have to try tomorrow. Which I think Mondays in Chicago are not like a very busy night. A lot of places close early or just don't open at all. And. Yeah. I don't think there's much going on at Navy Pier. We got some cool lights we're gonna go check out though. But I thought... And then there's a taco bar. Where? Across the street. Oh. Not technically on Navy Pier. Okay. Well, yeah, I thought that um, I, when I came to Chicago when I was a kid, I thought there was stuff going on on Navy Pier at night and they had like a bunch of lights and the Ferris wheel was all lit up, but... Well, I don't know. Friday night's probably different. And in the summer, maybe they, it know, is I'm summer. Way more busy because there, there's boats, you know, that whole marina that we walked by during the day in the summer. and. I'm sure it's a popping spot. Well, we got a cool view of the buildings, lit up at least. <laughs> and we got these things, these look cool. That would be a good Instagram picture, but John is sick of taking Instagram pictures of me. I had to take like five zillion. He told me that taking Instagram pictures makes him hate his life. <laughs> no, I said taking like a lot of Instagram photos every day for you because you literally make me take a picture like eight times and I think six is enough. Because I want you to get the stuff in six the background. But I do. I'm fantastic. No, not always. I have an eye for pictures. <laughs> Thank you